dumbass decided that you were gonna showboat on a motherfucking kick return. So I decided, yes yeah, sir, too easy. Let's go, finally tied this up, low as hell. And if Jamar wants to take one, that'll be fast as hell. Let's go, Jamar. Come on, baby, Kate York, put it in. Put it in. Ball game. To him. Let's go, Sketchy. Got him. AJ Brown, are you kidding me? AJ Brown. thus far and we're already in the playoffs i know you guys aren't used to this and i'm not either but damn i'm excited i'm ready to get rolling let's talk about the team heading into this first playoff game see what we can improve and hopefully get a fat w all right we've got an 84 overall with an 84 offense and 84 defense left tackle right tackle is amazing we got 85s and 86s the interior offensive line is weak think against a very elite defensive line it's gonna be tough to run the ball tony g the best tight end in the game i got no complaints there the only thing i'd like is a backup tight end because I do use them and Mo Ali Cox kind of scares me. Jamar, Justin Jefferson, and AJ Brown have been spectacular. I'm not messing with wide receivers. Javante Williams and Jerome Bettis has proven to be an insane duo. Zach Wilson made one of the nastiest throws I have ever seen in episode number five. I trust this man with my life. Got the jersey on. He's played great. Defense is actually what I'm most proud of now. This defense is insane. We got an 89 free safety Micah Hyde, our prestige player. So hoping he gets more cards down the line. We got our prestige Micah Parsons, who has been absolutely insane no matter where we play him. Junior Seau in the middle with Foyusada Lukan. They don't see a lot of reps because I run nickel defense, but it's always nice to have them in 3-4 in a pinch if I'm getting ran on. Steve Atwater, 89 overall, strong safety. We got him fully powered up with a monster game in game five, so we're ready to use him. AJ Terrell, Bobby McCain, Caleb Farley. I am a little sketchy about my corners. I would not mind upgrading just some true 87 overall beast corners. D-line got amazing with Robert Quinn, Emmanuel Ogba, but one of the best abilities this year is inside stuff. It's always been an amazing Ability. So I'd really like to get an inside stuff D tackle going into the playoffs here too. You guys get the idea? We got the playoffs wheel. It's a slightly juiced version of the wheel since we made it to the playoffs. We've got two playoff games to win. And it's the Campus Heroes Team Wheel. Campus Heroes Team Wheel is how we got Junior Seau. If we get the Chiefs, the Niners, or one other team, we get the 90 overalls. I'm trying to remember. Oh, Dolphins, we get Ricky Williams. All right, so we can get any Campus Heroes player. We're guaranteed at least an 87, but they must come from the... Not the Saints, but the Rep. That's the fucking Chase Young. Yes! Oh, yes! The commies have... And I was trying to get him last episode because he's so good. I am looking here for Chase Young. I chase young kids. Oh, I have a lot of friends with kids, right? This Chase Young, while he looks like an 87 left end, just like all the players I just got, he has baked in edge threat. Oh, that's such a big pickup. Massive start. All right, our first spin for playoff season is looking good. We've got two more here. Uh, before we hop into this game, let's get it, boys. Our spin is 2K per push-up can't drop. Let's go! You guys know this one, right? I don't gotta explain this. No lie, boys, I was aiming for 50, I got 45. Unfortunately, I'm incredibly tired from having so much sexual intercourse with your mother. So I'm just, I'm gassed, bro, I'm gassed. All right, so 45 push-ups times 2K per, 90K to spend on one player. That's gonna get us a stud. What position do we wanna upgrade for 90,000 coins, though? I think it's left guard. So I could get Thuni for 62K. 86 overall, Joe Thuni, significantly better than Bruce Matthews. I don't use all the coins, so I kinda went overboard on the push-ups, but hey, I'm gonna have big-ass milkers. All right, 86, Joe Thuni's in there. We still got an 81 center, 81 right guard. Eh. We got one more wheel spin. All right, boys, one final wheel spin before we got a playoff game on our hands. I'm looking for center, right guard, or D tackle. Ooh. I don't know if you guys have seen this one yet. So for every consecutive completion I get before throwing in complete is 10K. If I throw 15 straight passes and I never drop one, that's 150K. But I gotta win the game to even use this wheel spin. So my new starting D tackle will be Emmanuel Agba. Now this Chase Young is an absolute game changer. I'm serious. He has the best stats out of any of these ends. He makes Robert Quinn and Agba look like shit. 84 speed, 86 excel. His finesse moves are spectacular. Block shed's great. 6'5", 264. And he gets, it's really just about the edge threat. He gets edge threat. Zach Wilson. 
Wilson command us to a playoff win, sir. And before I spin this challenge wheel, there is a stipulation to the challenge wheel. Now, normally, if I complete the challenge wheel, I get one of any pack from the store that costs coins. If I complete the challenge wheel in the playoffs, I get one of any pack. Doesn't matter if it's training, doesn't matter if it's coins, I can take whatever I want. All right, challenge wheel, what do you got for me? I got a playoff game here. So don't give me anything absolutely ridiculous. It might be shut out one half. Shut out one half. I have to stop my opponent from scoring in an entire half of football. This is the playoffs. He's got Keyshawn, Mari Goda, and Micah Parsons. Damn it, I'm annoyed, dude. I fought my ass off for the playoffs. I want my logos on the field. Wait for it. Oh, dude, what the fuck? Is Quit. Get out of my playoff game, bro. Dude, give me some cop. Who are you throwing to and why? Robert Quinn with an INT in the playoffs. Dude, Javante Williams got daylight on the left side. You're telling me we're not housing this puppy? Let's go, Javante. Oh, hard cut? Yes, sir. All right, I'm not housing it. Damn, I'm not housing it. Tight end attack, bro. I haven't ran this all year. Let's roll out. Let's hit Javante. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Get inside, truck. Bro, I'm dead ass playing MMG right now. I wonder if I could get him. I wonder if... He's got to be talking on the mic, right? I'm going to log in and talk to him. Dude, I almost could have thrown that to A. Let's just go out of bounds with Zach. I'm plugging in the mic. Yo, you there? You guys won't be able to hear him, unfortunately. It's really stupid. I saw the mic lighting up. How you doing? How you doing, big baller? Dude, what is good? What is Cole. good, big baller? How you doing? Wait, hold on. I'm telling my cousin real quick. This is insane. Cole. <laughs> Cole, I... Fuck. All right, he hung up. Dude, wow, I watched like... Cole's fucking selling. What's he doing? He just hung up. I think he's in class. How you doing, my guy? Why aren't you in class? I start school tomorrow. Are you Buck? Are you a Ohio State fan? Is that why Buckeye man is? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dude, I was just at the Notre Dame-Ohio State game. That was nice. I know. I, I was there, too. I was there, too. Dude, why don't you come say what's good? Dude, I didn't know you were there. I saw your video, and I was like, fuck. Like, <laughs> I should have said, I was there with my grandpa. Dude, hey, Buckeye man, walk me through that first throw, bro. I've been wheeling my episode six. This is my first game in the playoffs. What was that first throw? I thought I thought he was going <laughs> to fucking, I saw MMG. I started freaking out. <laughs> I love it, dude. Hey, well, you're a stud. Uh, I hope you have a good game. I have to go back, so I got to do the commentary for this. But right, uh, You're a stud. Let's have an awesome game. All right, bet. Hey, you got anything to say to the video? Because you're going to be on the video. Raging like. Oh, I love yeah. you, bro. Like, you're going to see this video. You're not going to believe me. I don't give a shit. Nobody cares about all the trials and tribulations of your but like, This is insane. Oh, my God. I'm, like, smiling. <laughs> Mad heart. I love it, dude. I love it. All right, hey, well, let's have a good game, bro. Have a good day. Right, see you. Let's see it, Justin Reed. Ooh. Yeah, his accuracy is not very good. That was a 20-yard field goal, and that was harder than it should have been. All right, Buckeye, man. Let's see if he picks it up. Kyle Hamilton, big hit. See it, Buckeye. It goes with the draw play. I like it. I think this is going to be a throw to the tight end. Ooh, nice throw. Big hit. Oh, come on. We got to keep lighting him up. Big hit. Hey. Let's get a big hit. Oh. Okay, Saquon. No way. Could be a stretch. I'm going to get on Micah Hyde in case it's to the right. Okay, it's a pass. Good run. He gets in with Marty Goda. So we've got the ball to score and then get ball at half. So I like the clock here. All right, let's just play smart. Inside zone looks great here. Beautiful. Damn. Hunter verticals could get one here. Third and 12. Is this man cover? It's not man coverage. That leaves Jay Jettas wide open. Oh, what a hurdle. Yup. A. Okay, Javante, let's call a timeout. It's third and four. I can't hit this field goal, really? Damn, I gotta go for it, man, with 24 seconds. Jamar Chase! Oh, no! Randy Moss has got me. 19 seconds left. Damn, nice play. I wonder what he goes with on this. Does he run the ball? I kind of thought that'd be play action. He's just gonna heave one. Picked off by Terrell. Gives us a little momentum, actually, which I like. Good thing to get the INT. Don't gotta mess with anybody's abilities. Just gotta come out here and score. Bro, you just said you're a subscriber. You're gonna scum kick. Come on now. This is what you get. This is what you get for scum kicking. Sorry, mate, but this is what you get. Little mid blitz. I think I could run against this if we hold these blocks. Oh, yeah. Okay, Javante. Can't really tell what this defense is. I'm going Tony G. He's there. Touchdown. 
Let's go! Great opening drive. He leaves Tony G in the Tampa 2. Three-point lead. We scored that quick. And if I want to complete my challenge, I have to shut him out in this half. Play a read option. Sketchy. It is a pass. Nothing open. Oh, wait. Hello? All right, I'm sending a blitz. I knew it was going there. Big hit. Oh, I could have lurked it if I was a little quicker. Oh, second and 10 or first and 10. He is going to probably go handoff. Oh, he doesn't. Screamer. Good return, good stiff arm. See that water, a monster stop. And wait a minute. We've got the shutout in the second half as of right now. All right, let's go with a dive. Let's send this right up the middle. He does not have bodies there that can stop this. Yes, sir. Hey, let's bring this left side stretch. Third and one. I'm actually going to run it. Oh, damn. Fourth and one. Sketchy, but I'm doing it. Cut it up the middle. Javante's got it. Ooh. Ooh, Javante. Nice play. Out the backfield. Halfback. Halfback. Beautiful, Javante. We do that every time. Good hard cut. I'm going to try halfback base here. He's seen a lot of passes. Ugh. Nice stiff arm, but I think you just lost the yards, Javante. Wow. Wide open, Javante Williams. He was in a Tampa 2 before when I hit Tony G for the touchdown. I might be able to get him again. Just have to see what he looks at. Ooh. Wait, can he, he can't catch Javante! Oh, he's down to the one, he's not in! Javante! Pull some clock off, let's go stretch left side. One more, Javante, one more, let's go! A minute on the clock in the fourth quarter. Javante Williams puts it in. If we can shut him out for this final minute of the game, we complete our challenge. Ooh, look who's lit up. None other than 89 Atwater. Halfback. Nice pass. Keep him in bounds. We got to let him throw inbounds. Yes, sir. Damn, nice pass. I wonder if he'll go for the touchdown right now. Oh my God, what a throw down to the four. How does he punch it in though? Because he's got to punch this in. We know it's a pass. We've got commits. Oh, Robert Quinn for a second INT. He could house this. Let's go, Robert Quinn. Started the game with it, ended the game with it. And that's all she wrote. Javante Williams will take one last handoff. That's a shutout in the second half. Let's go. And the Lions and Zach Wilson win the wildcard playoff game. Let's get it. Let's look at the stat comparison. So Mariota, 51.9. He actually threw more yards than me. It was just those interceptions, dude. Robert Quinn had him boxed up. 9 for 13, Zach Wilson. Not my best game. I had an INT and I had a TD as well. Rushing, Javante continues to prove he's a stud. 50 for 53 isn't the best averages, but still got a touchdown and five broken tackles. I completely forgot about completions before incompletions. Dude, it was a playoff game, okay? I, I completely forgot. I'm gonna go back through the footage right now and check. All right, so I get 20K to spend on on one player. You know what's funny? 20k ain't shit, but it actually gets me a better center than what I have right now. Dude, Jason Kelsey, 84 overall center. I'm cool with that. He is actually boosted to an 85 with my strategy. So that's an 80, 87 left tackle, 86 left guard, 85 center. Only thing I got to worry about now is right guard and my O line's done. Now, of course, we did complete our challenge wheel for our shutout in the second half, which means I get one of any pack in the store. So now if you look in the training store, there's nothing that's really good. I could get an eight, a guaranteed 80 plus campus hero, but as the season progresses, we get flashback players, veterans, rising stars, you get team of the year. Usually the training store is more juiced, but for now, my best bet is still a Legends Fantasy Pack. First one, Bill Sean Phillips, Austin Larkin, Logan Wilson, Julian Aquara. I don't think I've, all right, so nothing. Ooh, a legend to start us out. 83 Bettis doesn't help me. Oh my God, I'm gonna get a triple legend top. Jeremy Shockey, wait, that's, an, oh, that's so good. That's huge. I wanted to, ooh, and it's 86 McAllister? Chris McAllister. Let me see, size and speed. 6'1", 85, speed. He's a fucking beast. And then Jeremy Shaq could be my backup tight end instead of Mo Ali Cox. That was an awesome pack right there. Buckeyes said so many unlucky plays, but good luck. Hey, appreciate it, Buckeye. I'm gonna need it. I got another playoff game and then the Super Bowl. All right, boys, we're an 85 overall going into our second playoff game. We're 6-0. and We have not lost the game at Wheel of Mutt yet. Boys, thank you for watching as always. Got another playoff game and then the Super Bowl. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace!